All right, so it is a joyous day for XS Tentacion and his fans, man. The three guys involved in his case have all been found guilty of murder and robbery in the first degree. Now, if you don't know what first degree murder is or first degree robbery, it just means that this was planned out, that you at some point in time came up with the plan or had intentions on doing this way before it happened. And so in Florida that I know of, that is a mandatory life and or a death um, sentence. So, uh, of course, you guys let me know which one you, got, you think these guys should get down below but regardless these guys weren't too smart when this happened these guys were pretty much quick to take it to instagram to show that they had all of this money and you know it's it, it's it's just 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 dumb all the way around man these were like one of the worst criminals ever man and you know i know that there was a point in time in the case where people thought drake did it um and so that was found to be debunked um that's a whole nother conversation of why drake was dissing X after he passed if he didn't have anything to do with it but you know I, I still want to know what you guys feel about that as well do you still feel like uh drake had something to do with it or not but regardless again this is a good day um, i'm glad to see that these guys are off the streets and that they're definitely going to end up getting life at the very least even if they don't get death my thing is it's just like you know i just hate it had to even have to come to that man it's like once you robbed them once you had them trapped in you know you took the money why did you have to kill him too it just seems like every time we have a great great artist um a transitional artist somebody that's going to you know that can literally be a legend um in his case he is going to be a legend it's like why do they always have to die young it's just so annoying man because he was such a great artist but regardless man it's been a great day um to know that that they got it right that there's no hiccups in their judgment everybody got exactly what they freaking deserved um i'm not sure if i touched it on yet but you know if, if a lot of you are wondering why the third person got um got uh murder and robbery even though he didn't do you know necessarily pull the trigger um most states look at it as a cause and effect thing they look at it like well if, the, if you wouldn't have took him there if you wouldn't have drove him there then this wouldn't have happened um and so that's why a lot of the times too when you catch people getting caught in drive-bys or different things like that they usually play the i didn't know card because that's usually what they try to do they try to play on the fact that um play on the fact that they were ignorant to what was going to happen um so that's the answer to that for anybody that might have that kind of question as well but anyway man um again great day i'm so happy to hear that those guys got the book thrown at them.